Each part or assembly in Eris Innovator that includes 3D data, like this high-level assembly of a robot arm, can be experienced visually, even by non-CAD users. This is a static, monolithic view of the assembly, where its CAD visualization appears on the right, and its model browser, including part and bill of materials structure, appears on the left. Users control the display style, choosing to create and save markups, measurements, exploded views, and cross-sections. In contrast, dynamic product navigation in Eris Innovator offers many different views of PLM data in context with CAD data. It uses queries to populate the 3D scene, meaning users can filter the data they see based on the information and insights they need. The tree grid view on the left is based on a query definition set up by administrators. Parameters let you filter this view by available properties, like filtering to released parts, as we've done here. Views let you highlight different parts of the CAD model using these properties. Here we've chosen all released parts, so let's filter by latest revision and then view released and unreleased parts. Now we've narrowed our highlighted parts down just to those that are unreleased. In the next example, let's view cost data from PLM in context with the CAD viewable. Here we'll set a cost threshold of $55 and filter our view by cost. For companies seeking to quickly and visually pinpoint high-cost parts, say over $100 as we're doing now, this streamlined, interactive visual experience can be made available to any user with very low training overhead compared to most CAD or PLM experiences. Effectivity is a complex concept in PLM, assigning dates for which alternate parts at the same place in a product's bill of material structure are effective. For product and services companies employing a 150% bill of materials, managing part effectivity can streamline their processes. In dynamic product navigation, you can easily interrogate models for part effectivity, filtering by date to visualize just the part that was effective at that point in time. In addition to recalling views set up by your administrator, users can easily save their own favorite views within dynamic product navigation. The camera angle plus the parameters and filter settings are all saved, and each time the query is rerun, the latest product information is served in the view. In this way, dynamic product navigation is extremely flexible to meet the needs of all users. Administrators can configure new queries to match new processes across the lifecycle, and users can configure their own preferred views into their product lifecycle data quickly and interactively.